I'm here today to review a couple of different body oils and their smell for the Egyptian musk yellow. The top note is a citrus smell. For the Egyptian musk 24 karat, there are different fruit smells and spices that meld it out to have a mellow Egyptian musk smell, but it has a little bit of a sm spice smell to it. And that's a very little spice smell. Next, I have the Egyptian goddess. And that one is a cousin to the Egyptian musk yellow. This is a little bit thicker, but not to be compared to other companies that have the same fragrance called Egyptian Goddess. It is not going to be the same. And it is a cousin to my version of the Egyptian Musk Yellow. This is the Egyptian Musk Yellow. Next up is the coconut. And the coconut is very concentrated. So you would have to put only a little dab on your wrist and then wait for it to air out. And then it smells like you are on the beach. Next up is the vanilla. And this one is like a very deep, creamy smelling vanilla. And um, it has a top note that is uh, like a beany, creamy smell. That is the vanilla. This, the Sex on the Beach, is like the drink. <laughs> it has a lot of different fruits. And it's a mixture of fruits. And it's a little louder than all of the rest of the um, body oils. And this one, so not necessarily when something is um, like a thinner oil, this one is definitely strong. So this myth that the thick oils are stronger is just a myth because this one is definitely lasts uh, a long, long, long time and is much bolder. And it could stay in the pile of laundry for a couple of days. <laughs> Next is the Kush. And this one also is a very thin oil. But like I say, this one kind of have a little licorice smell to it, and it has deep, deep um, spices, and it um, would stay with you a couple of days and in the laundry pile a couple of days, maybe before you laundered it. <laughs> and this one is the Egyptian musk red. Uh, similar to the Kush in the amount of spices that's in it. And um, I would say that this one uh, lasts all day, has lots of spices, is some musk, but it has some fruits and also uh, the top notes could be the spices. Um, there's rose in it and all different nice spices in it and this one is the egyptian musk clear and this is also called the egyptian musk clear vintage powdery fresh and clean smell 
And this one is the top three Egyptian musk. There's the Egyptian clear, which is this one. There is the Egyptian yellow with the citrus note as the top note. And then there's the goddess. And then there's the Egyptian red. And most people are going for the clear and the yellow. So that is our descriptions for today. And tune in again at zeldasaromatics.com.